Okay, so this of course got to be the final, or I guess season one finale for Breaking Ground. You know, even leading up to NXT respect, take over respect. Now what they did smart is they spent a lot of time focusing on the, the, the Bailey Sasha Banks match, which was awesome. You know, first time you ever had women main eventing a live network special, which by itself was fantastic. As well as the Dusty Rose uh, Tag Team Classic. And we also get to have our first call-up. The nice thing was they actually did specifically kind of go out in their way and say, you know, when it comes to who does the call-ups, it's pretty much Vince. Vince controls who shows up on the main roster, as well as what happens with people on the main roster. You know, and Triple H, again, expresses that, you know, the idea behind NXT is that you're ready for the main roster. While at the same time, picking up some guys who I think he just really wants to work with. So... As always, nice background when it comes to everything going on with NXT. They did a really, really good job when it came to, you know, here's the here's the buildup for TakeOver Respect. Here's Bailey having a small mental breakdown. You know, this is a really well-crafted show. And I liked, too, that, you know, I made mention of the new finisher that uh, we have to see Apollo Crews use. And... Triple H was like, you know, your finisher, it's nice. He needs something else. You know, he wanted to push him to do something that's not like what he's done for the for his indie career, which was cool. You know, because so is it one, they know they had an indie career. Two, that, you know, you can you can have what you did there. It's a great way to get yourself noticed, but you can do something else. And I'll say I actually really like that aspect. You, know, you can reinvent yourself here in NXT. It's part of the reason why it exists. You know, they showed the the jelliness of, of Gable and Jordan. They did a bit of a recap in the history with that would let go. And I love that they showed the after takeover event. They showed everyone in the back, they showed them all and looked like a giant classroom discussing all the aspects of it. He's like, you know, people made themselves that night. You saw people who really, really went out there and put on a phenomenal match. It made sense, and they went forward with it. As well as talking about the Tag Team Classic. Showing a little bit with Cody and uh, Dustin. Dusty? Dustin? Sorry. Just fantastic. Great stuff. Great stuff. This has been a really solid season. I'd like to see how I would play for you to watch it end to end to end, but by far, this is, again, one of the reasons why you own the network. You own the network for NXT and for the specials. The pay-per-views... There's the free bonus.